lets you play different score segments of the music sheet. So we just go and select different score segments. And now it's playing these segments so you can... You can also get uh, an overview of this segmentation, just look in the device perspective view. What we suggest is we again put the phone on the surface, interactive surface, bring there and then start annotation altering and just do another one. So now we got two annotations here, yeah. now we can also view them in, in an overview. And I, the idea is to bridge the gap between the digital, with the, between the physical and digital space. <laughs> what we're doing right now is we're tracking the pose of the camera. You see areas that we, uh, we haven't seen before are getting filled in with green, this green texture. And that's doing the reconstruction of the, the environment. So the, the areas which go green are areas which have been reconstructed. We have a little mini game. We switch off reconstruction and now we can choose where we want our play area to be. So now we create basically a virtual sea and you can see things we reconstructed are poking through the sea as, as islands. From yeah, so we, we stop the reconstruction phase. Your, your hand will appear in there if you stick it in, but we're not, we're not doing any reconstruction, so it won't actually be reconstructed. So doing the, the depth fusion is, is very fast, yeah. um, but getting the colors right is, is, is what's taking most of the time, actually. Yeah. Okay, so we will now start yeah, with the last part of the video and the video challenge. Yeah, the scenario four. Where we have two participants. <laughs> on the one hand, the IGD really from cool. Germany, and on the other hand, the Institute for Info so, yeah. Research from Singapore. Nice. Yeah. Um, the depth sensor, this is monocular, and what we're doing here is we're showing that we're also using lines, not just point features, but lines uh, to be able to track. So in an environment, this is a, a pretty feature-rich environment, but an environment that's a little bit more, that has less features, we can still track effectively by making use of these lines. You see the, the, the line features that are like around the, the shapes here. They don't have a lot of texture, mm -hmm. um, but they have, they're rich in lines. Sure. So we can track using that. Oh. Uh, a physical point into virtual point. Yeah. Right? So now, let me go, uh, let me go and mess with it. I'm just gonna go and mess with the camera. I'm gonna lock the camera settings. No, this is like And one of the, one of the toys tries to follow uh, whatever it has happened to the, to the, to the, to the camera. Mm. The other one is just a regular render. The other one is mm. what typically happens. And I can go and mess with it even more. You can see it also gets a little bit of a yellowish color. And I can unlock the camera settings for the thing, the thing to uh, have a, a, another...